Let's go outside, the snow is falling down And every child is having so much fun The snowman is twice the size as me With a smile as quirky as mine We're holding hands to keep each other warm While we stand and watch a choir perform And all the Christmas songs that we love Get yeah, all the Christmas songs that we love And in a while we're gonna go inside And drink our chocolate by the fire Guys, we just got a couple packages in the mail and side note, sending presents is literally taking me all day freaking long. But I wanted to film our reactions to this present because it's from one of Jack's main clients. She's literally the sweetest human on the face of this planet. Oh my gosh. That's what it's like when you work with people and they like personally take the time to like send you a present. It's, it's so like... Nice. It's so nice, like, it's like friends and family, like, that's so nice in general, but like, a client that you like, do business with, like, that is so freaking cool, like, oh my gosh, there's a card! <laughs> Wait, that's so cute! Oh my gosh, Kim is so funny. Wait, <laughs> look what we see when we open the box! Dude, it's, it's a swag. <laughs> that's so freaking cool. Jack, thank you for all your hard work in 2020. Oh. We love all the fantastic reports you create for us and amazed at your ability to pull together the valuable data. I hope you have so a restful Christmas and New Year holiday and look forward to working with you in 2021. Oh Thanks. my gosh. Kurt, Zach. That is so cute. Baby, she made this card. That's awesome. Like, yeah, she, like, it has multiple it. Layers, layers of like card stock. <laughs> that is so they're so awesome. Oh my gosh, open it. What is this? Is this a, oh my gosh, it's a bag. Marvel's Avengers. Oh like, no, it's bag. literally a nerd kit of Marvel's Avengers. <laughs> this is like Everything. all the stuff they do for like, <laughs> like their partnerships. Yeah. Oh my gosh, this is Holy so crap. Cool. Stickers, a notebook. Oh my Baby. gosh. Socks. You love Marvel socks. Avengers socks. They have stickies on the bottom. Do you feel They're that? Yeah, I do. They're the Hulk. What else you got? I think those are t-shirts. I think we got tons of t-shirts. Oh, yeah. Oh, holy crap. You are all set to be nerding out working from home. This stuff is so cool. <laughs> they sent me a medium and a large. You can have one, bub. So aesthetic. So cute. Oh, my gosh. This <gasps> is so cool. Oh, we love those. Yes. Oh. This is going on the desk. On the desk. Wow. That is really cool. That's a good one. Oh my gosh, she sent you another one. We can have it on both of the desks. Really freaking cool. That's so right. That's with adventure. Baby All swag. swag. Wow. So right. Anyways, friends, good morning, everybody. It is Dingle here, and welcome or welcome back to my channel. I hope y'all are doing super, super duper well, and welcome to Vlogmas Day again. I'm not sure. But we are uploading ever. Oh, my mom just now texted me. I texted like five people to get an address for something because, okay, literally, I'm sending out four presents today. Two are for the Secret Santa. I keep talking about the family Secret Santa. And honestly, sending presents is so complicated. I hate sending packages. Sending packages in general is just complex. But like, I don't know anyone's address. Like, we just like text and communicate by like internet all the time. And then getting the gift wrapping ready because they charge you an arm and a leg for all of the packaging. And one time I had to send something at FedEx and they had me buy this whole like roll of something. So I'm glad I kept it because I was able to wrap a bunch of stuff. But I literally don't know what to do. I just usually like go into FedEx and I'm like, can you wrap? I I need to send these packages. Like I know that there's probably a way to do it where you can like print off the label online and you know, use your own boxes and stuff like that, which is great. But we recycle like all of our boxes as soon as we get them. We don't have like the space to just keep storing boxes. So anyway, that's a hassle in itself. Let me know if you guys also find sending packages and just like dealing with USPS or FedEx or whatever service you use. Like, they make it really easy. They just charge a freaking arm and a leg. And the thing is two of these, the secret Santa for our family have to get there by Friday. Into it. Oh my gosh, it looks great, baby. <laughs> You're definitely an XL. Yeah, I'll, I'll put it. I'll put it on display. How flattering that she thought you were a large, though. <sighs> I mean, it look. You look like like it is so form fitted. 
Yeah, it is. But like in a good way. Like if you wanted to wear do I, that. Do I look like a superhero? You do because look at your pecs. They are just like perfectly <laughs> sculpted. But yeah, that's what we were doing today. And then also I just got an exciting package in the mail, which is Warby Parker. I ordered their at-home try-on service where you can order like five different styles of glasses. And they're not prescription or anything yet, but you try them on at home instead of just like relying on a virtual try-on to then like order glasses glasses that are over like a hundred bucks. They send you like up to five so you can try them on. So I thought we would try them on later together and then you guys could help me pick them because it's Vlogmas and we're uploading every single weekday and I have like three days to pick them. So you guys can let me know which ones you think and I can actually use your all's opinions. I don't know. Hello. Whenever I'm vlogging, she thinks I'm talking to her. Oh, I am talking to you. Anyway, guys, I'm going to try and search up people's addresses in order to send these things, but wish me luck. With you. Let me give you a Christmas a moment will fill with love and joy. Mm -mm, so beautiful, kissing on a mistletoe, baby, with you. I don't need any presents. As long as I spend this day with you mm -mm, so I just spent $129 shipping four packages I don't want to talk about it I don't want to talk about it Hello friends, I just finished lunch Let me just close this so Jack can focus on work And I honestly couldn't help it I was so excited to open my try-on glasses I got five of the try-on ones from Warby Parker I think I mentioned that before And it's so easy, like literally It's awesome They come with a return label right here You just stick that back on the box When you're ready to like ship them back After you've like ordered the pair you like It doesn't say that I can't do this again like if I don't like any one of these pairs I think I could just do it again and get like five completely different pairs it comes with these steps here so it's like you know ask around which ones you like and then they say we can help and you can like text the stylist for free and they can let you know like which ones fit your face better you order the pair that you like with the prescription and everything and I don't have prescription I don't wear a prescription but I'm getting these just for blue light glasses and you can get like no prescription and just blue light to off of their website which is super cool and I love their frames and I love Warby Parker's story so I wanted to go through them and then you go ahead and you send back this box and then you wait for your new pair so I wanted to show you guys just in case you guys had an opinion on like which one looks the best I think the toughest thing is I love bigger framed glasses but that doesn't necessarily look best for my nose type it definitely like accentuates the nose and I don't don't really want to do that but I love the look of bigger glasses if that makes sense so we got a few different colors a few different frame sizes so I can like look around but I think look at these ones oh my gosh okay let's just get into it I'm in the bathroom so that I can like look in the mirror to get a real sense of like how they look and stuff but this is the first pair this is called the Francis in rose water so it is literally like a clear type of pink color and I'm obsessed with this and I love the frames but again I think I think these ones are just too big for my face you see that it's like oh this is your face and then you put on something like this and I just feel like it goes like bam there's your nose but I really like these I just think that they're like really big but let me know what you guys think I definitely love the color of them so much I love the clear look I think it's super cute but I think what I'm gonna do is definitely like confirm that I do like this clear look and then I'll try on a bunch of different styles and the style will come first and then we'll just see like what color they come in when I go to order like the real ones okay so this one is Sadie Sadie M that's the style in oak barrel they are this darker tortoise shell type of glasses here's what they look like just a darker type of tortoise shell and they've got like those round frames to them those are kind of cute I kind of look like a little nerdy scientist let me see them <laughs> in the bathroom. I kind of like these when I look at them more like in the mirror with like my full type of getup. I think that the smaller frames are definitely, definitely much better than the larger frames. Cause this is what the larger frames look like. Oh no, now I actually think that these aren't that bad and they're really freaking cute. <laughs> oh man, now with like the whole getup, I think this is kind of cute. Oh, I can totally see me wearing these. Oh no, okay. Well, we'll just start trying them on in this mirror because I think it's getting like a better representation of 
how I'll look with my glasses on. Okay, I kind of like these ones. Oh my gosh, oh no. These ones are called the Durand M and they are in rose water as well. And they look very similar shape to these darker tortoise shell ones right here, but I would say the tortoise shell ones are maybe a little bit rounder than these ones. I'm trying to see them side by side. They actually look very similar. I would say these ones have a slightly flatter bottom to them than these ones. I don't know if you can tell. These ones have more of a flick out to them maybe. I don't know. They're very similar though. So let's see what they look like in rose water. They're also super cute. I think they're adorable. I kind of don't know if they're too small for my face, like these like smaller frames type of glasses. I think I like them a little bit more on how they sit on my face and on my nose than the bigger ones, but the bigger ones are also so cute. So I think I like these better than the tortoise shell ones just because the color is like so cute and it's they're just very similar. So I think I'm leaning more towards a lighter framed glasses. And rose water, the fact that they're pink are just kind of a plus, so I think these ones over the darker ones. Still looking at those bigger frame glasses though. These ones are called the Hues and they're also a bigger type of frame and they're in tan crystal Havana. So they're not pink, they're more of like a light tan type of like tortoise kind of color. These are them compared to these ones up here. And as you can see, I wanna say they're almost exactly the same. Maybe these ones have a little bit of a smaller frame, but either way, let's try them on. I do like these ones. They fit like higher up on my face, I feel like, than the rose water ones. I'm not really sure, but I'm definitely sold, I think, on pink. But let's just see. Let's see them side by side. So those ones are the hues, and then the pink ones look like this. I think they go down further. Do they not? I honestly don't know. Okay, so these ones I feel like are nearly identical. I think these ones sit higher up on my cheekbones, though. I think that's the difference there. They're definitely the square shape without as far down on the face. At least it feels that way. So I like them. These are the hues. And then the next ones are called Percy and they're also in tan crystal Havana and they're another round type of shape. But compared to the round pink ones, I would say they have, oh gosh, they're like nearly similar. I think the bottom ones are slightly more round. Like they have way more of a circle than the top ones. I think these are a little more irregular. And then compared to these ones, I would say they're pretty similar. Maybe the glass is slightly bigger than these ones. I think these ones are slightly too small for my face, but I'm unsure. I do like the color. I like how they look. Oh, I'm not sure, you guys. I have no idea. I need your help. I just realized that I had a pepper in my tooth the whole time I was talking to you guys. I hope you didn't notice. I think these ones are a little bit small for my face. <laughs> I think as I always am, I'm slightly obsessed with this larger size, but this is where you guys come in. You guys are the first step with the Warby Parker situation because it says, ask around. It says, see what your friends and family think of your frames. And I'm like, yes, I will see what my friends think of my frames. But guys, I think that's going to be it for today's Vlogmas. Thank you guys so much in advance for helping me pick the frames. I'm totally at a loss. I like really every single one of them. I feel like I can't go wrong. I'm just really excited that I'm finally going to get a pair of blue light glasses so I can just protect my eyes a little more on all of the screens that I work on during the day. I'm going to go stick a crock pot meal in for today's dinner and it's going to be, it's going to be a new one. So I don't really want to vlog it. I'll just let you guys know how it turns out and if I like it I'll show it to you guys but anyway if you've made it all the way to the end of this video and you have not hit the subscribe button yet make sure you do so down below because we are uploading every single weekday during vlogmas everybody do not forget to give this video a big old thumbs up before you go and I will catch you tomorrow my friends I'll see you guys later bye it's cold outside but the fire keeps us warm we can spend the night so tall and I've gotten you a present that I put under the tree tomorrow